Anamika from Vaishri Makeup YouTube channel and today I'm going to talk about two blushes which I recently got from my strawberry.net haul which I showed you guys also. I did a video and uh, if you want to see that video then you can uh, check out in the description box or I'm going to link it here on somewhere in the video so you can have a look what all I got from strawberry.net and uh, the blushes which I got is Mock Makeup Forever blushes. These are the improved version of their previous blushes. The previous one used to come in a pump bottle. They were used to be a huge bottle uh, which was two years back was of 1600 rupees and uh, everyone wanted them. What? Uh, but if you, if I compare these blushes with the, those bottle blushes, these are completely different. You cannot compare both of them because uh, first of all the packaging is, is different and uh, uh, those brushes have to be carefully uh, used but these are very easy to use even if you are new with cream blushes and you want to you are looking for some brushes to start with then check these out because they are very very easy to blend and um, you can use your finger to blend them out or you can use any of your favorite uh, blush blush to blend them out the packaging of these blushes the name the number of they have given the number of the blush at the back of the bl blush case and it's a beautiful plastic packaging the, the quality of the plastic is nice and it has an inbuilt mirror in it and uh, you can even depot these blushes which makes them quite interesting small uh, there's a small hole here given uh, you need to you can take a safety pin or any pen hair pen and which can just go inside uh, the blush and press it here and here you go you have your you have your depotted blush it is little smaller than the MAC blushes but as it's a cream blush uh, it's going to last you really really long that thing and especially when the formula itself is so good compared to MAC you will you're going to really like that like the packaging and the blush only thing which I don't like about this blush is that the name of the blush is given on the outer packaging they have given the number at the back so I wish they would have they could have given the name also at the back of the blush so that I can remember if, if the name if uh, I happen to collect four or five of them the shade which I have is 310 and 320 and the one which I am wearing is 320 which is an English rose shade. It's a rosy shade uh, uh, which, uh, which looks very very natural on my skin and gives me a healthy flush kind of a look. Let me just zoom in my camera to make you give you an idea. I have used quite a bit of uh, the blush but uh, as the blush just melts into my skin it looks very natural and i didn't have to make much of an effort or i have to worry about um, the quant the quantity which i have to apply because it, it's really easy to manage that also i oily skin girls are going to like this blush because it's it is very very lightweight if you see other cream blushes they make you see feel as if there is something sitting on your cheeks but this as the texture is different from the previous one or the regular blushes also um, it is better than the MAC blushes or the NYX, NYX blushes the, that is why I am completely in love with these because my skin tends to go a little oily in summers therefore I have to just put them these blushes aside but with uh, Makeup Forever blushes with little bit of loose powder I am I, uh, definitely going to manage it up uh, stain power of this blushes is quite good. These are available in 16 shades uh, ranging from cool to warm skin tone. Therefore, even if you are like cool till tone, you are fair, you are dark, you are olive skin tone, you are brown skin tone, you are definitely going to find um, your kind of shade in it. If you are my my skin tone, which is N which ranges between NC42 to 42, you are definitely going to love these uh, these shades 320 or 310 but i recommend to uh, go with only one uh, of them because uh, both of them more or less are similar uh, 320 is a rosy shade whereas 310 is 
little rosy brown so this one is can be used by a skin tone which is little darker than my skin tone but and both of them are going to look very very natural this, do these blushes sound amazing to you yes they are I'm pretty sure that these blushes are going to be loved by so many girls be it combination oily or dry skin because the kind of uh, texture which these blushes have is something which you generally don't get uh, in high-end blushes too. Uh, in drugstore blushes, I am yet to know any kind of a blush which is which has the same kind of a uh, uh, texture. I do remember using Revlon cream blush, the one which comes in a pot packaging. Uh, that is little bit newer, but just little bit. The kind of uh, the way this blush melts into the skin and gives you that absolute amazing, healthy, that uh, after gym kind of glow. It's something which is rare to get get with other blushes. Blushes are a hit. From, uh, from my side they are easy to use easy to blend will last long with a cute packaging you can depot them they can easily be purchased online as well from strawberry and uh, you're going to absolutely love them so i'm going to see you again with a new video and if you like this video then don't forget to like and share it with your friends till then bye, -bye.